Hello and welcome to this Android Studio tutorial. I'm Cal and today we're going to be adding an app icon to your Android Studio project. Cool, so creating a new Android Studio project. This is an empty activity. We're going to call it app icon example tutorial. First thing we're going to do is just run the application. We're going to press home and create a shortcut to our new app. And you can see that our app icon is the default green Android. So this default file is just sitting here in our res folder. And what we want to do is override this file. So what we're going to do is say file new image asset. And you can see we've got the name here, IC launcher is the default and an icon with that name already exists. So we're going to override this file. Um, I've just got my icon selected here on my desktop and I'm just going to select that and then you can scale it. So just making that a little bit smaller. Cool. And if you can see, we've got selected the foreground layer and that's looking pretty good. However, our background layer is still that green uh, check. So what I'm going to do is select on our background layer. I'm going to change it from an image to being a color and I'm going to use the eyedropper tool to just select this sort of dark gray. So that's looking pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that now. So what we're going to do is just hit next and finish and that should override all of the files. And for some reason, um, I think it had a different, slightly different file name. You can see we've got our IC launcher now and we just want to remove these IC launcher.webp and the same thing in our round. Cool, so that's really it. We can build and run this now and you can see that our icon is now our new icon. Cool, so next what we're gonna do is quickly head into the manifest and see what is actually happening. So this is where you define your icon as well as your round icon. Um, you can see that it's actually looking at this XML file and it just so happens that we overread the IC launcher so we didn't have to change anything. But if you did want to keep an icon and you just wanted to have a second one, perhaps, uh, without actually deleting the original icon. So just do the same thing. We're gonna say new image asset and we're gonna select instead of an image, we're gonna say text. Uh, the text I'm gonna give it CWC, so code with Cal. And the name we're gonna call this text icon, making sure that it's all lowercase and just gonna leave it as that green color. So we're just gonna hit finish. So to make our application point at our new text icon, what we need to do is just change our icon as well as our round icon to be from our IC launcher to our new text icon. And if we build and run this again, you can see that we've now got our green icon with our text. Cool, so that's how you change an app icon in Android Studio. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.